I have thought about my water legacy and started creating it at the beginning of my career. I thought that engineering, especially water treatment engineering, wastewater treatment engineering, was something I could do to help um, maintain a balance between the environment and human development. And that kept me satisfied. I felt like I was really in a vigorous field where this was helpful to both, well, the whole, all of life. Around the year 2000, I discovered that climate change really was happening. I read up on it and gave climate change information as my topic for opening session in 2012 when I was president of PNCWA. That is the continuing legacy that I keep striving to provide information on. So I'll talk to almost anybody about climate change, about clean water, about how important all of it is to maintain the health of the planet that we live on. I've spent my past in foreign countries. I grew up in Africa and experienced the water environment there and also lived in South America where I worked with small indigenous communities. During that time, the communities at the top of the hill would take their water from the upper side of an irrigation canal and then they would discharge to the lower side of that canal. The next community downstream would do exactly the same thing. I learned from that that water environment and water quality are very important. I'm also working with rural communities, and those folks need the same thing. Their biggest challenges are affordability and education. So through my past and my present, I'm able to do a lot with water quality. I encourage everybody out there to do the same and educate young people to know how important water resources are. Thank you very much. I find the wastewater career very inspirational. Since I started my career early as an operator, I was always interested in the sciences, and I found that the wastewater field, being an operator, you're able to deal with the sciences. You have biology, chemistry, physics, and as I carried that on and got older, I really enjoyed working with the younger people became the chair of the Students' Young Professionals Committee and really saw at that time how inspirational and how dedicated the younger people were and were able to kind of begin mentoring and helping younger people and I find that more inspirational now than the business itself. It's wonderful to be part of the whole clean water. Um, the wastewater professional spends a lifetime cleaning up the water. Like I've said many times in the past in presentations that a wastewater professional does more environmental protection in, in one day than an attorney can do in a lifetime in, in, in lawsuits. That day-to-day 24-7 -day, protection of the environment is what the wastewater professional does. And as, as I get older and, and leave this industry, there are a lot of younger people I'm very proud to to see and to watch and that I've been able to, to know as their careers develop that can carry on this legacy into the future. <laughs>